Hey guys, what's up? Welcome or welcome back to the channel. So in today's video, we're gonna be doing a self-care. I would say day, but it's not gonna be day, it's multiple days. So we're just doing a self-care vlog. So I hope y'all like this. I'm starting slowly. I'm starting to feel like myself again. Y'all see I got on makeup, like a full face, but I just filmed a makeup video. So that's why I'm all dialed up, but yes you guys i hope you enjoyed this video make sure you give it a thumbs up if you're not already subscribed to the channel pause this video and subscribe down below make sure you hit that post notification bell so you don't miss upload from me and let's get into this vlog hey y'all what's up so i have been obsessed with press on nails because first of all they are super fun to put on you can get so many different designs and styles but most importantly like when i take off press on nails i still have a nice natural healthy nail underneath they're not brittle they're not chipping and that's one thing i hated about the nail salons is that when i take off my nails or the false nails my real nail is like chipping cracking splitting and so weak and thin and i'm just over so honestly i haven't even been to a nail salon to get my nails done in forever because i've just been rocking press on side note this massage felt so good this was much needed like so much needed <laughs> she did amazing on me hi guys my hair this is what it's looking like i'm about to shampoo it though because i need to do something to my hair i was gonna do a solo in but i really don't feel like like braiding my hair down but y'all look at this the balls are getting bigger and bigger it's kind of stressing me out <laughs> i'm reading this book by eric thomas called you owe you is such a good read so far i literally just started it monday i'm on chapter three i was supposed to read it today um i probably i could still read it i guess well, i got the hair mask on but um it's so good like it's just teaching me stuff about myself and a lot of stuff that i'm reading to i'm going to incorporate it in, into like the rest of this year and also next year definitely next year for sure i'm just excited to finish reading that book because it's already like I'm, i was reading it literally he's dropping so many gems in that book and i'm just like oh my god to like even comb out my hair especially while it's wet oh my goodness girl no ma'am this is for the birds y'all like postpartum shedding i can't like i cannot with this like it's just it's too much i really want to get some braids to be honest i mean i don't i really don't care for braids like that but now i probably honestly i probably get freaked out more like once i take my braids down <laughs> it's probably gonna be hella shedding that smells so good oh good morning you guys today is a wednesday well it was actually morning when i talked to y'all a few hours ago i woke up late 7 15 trying to start waking up at like 5 but i knew i wasn't gonna wake up like i mean i woke up but i went right back to sleep because jana she was like tossing and turning the past couple hours so i really didn't sleep that much so i knew i wasn't gonna get up at five so we're up now i'll check this out my hair is kind of like almost, well, I be looking so pale in the morning. I'm just going to let it finish air drying. It's almost done. It's just the top is still a little wet, but I'm going to, I'm going to pump and then I'm, I'm going to work out. Y'all, let me just say this. I'm so proud of myself for showing up for the past two weeks straight, not missing a day, minus Sunday, since so my rest day, but just getting up, not making no excuses, and just putting in this work, whether it's a 30, 45 minute, or an hour workout, but just moving my body, feeling good, and it's just putting me in such a good mood, and I'm loving that for myself. 
hey guys so i'm back the workout was so good i'm sore already but i like it when i'm sore it means i'm working <laughs> so yana she went down for a nap she'll probably be asleep maybe about an hour or so because she was fussing my workout I only did like 45 minutes because she just kept crying and everything so it was still a good workout sweated a lot i love when i sweat when i work out i'm eating my breakfast so it is can y'all see it it's strawberry and banana with cinnamon and some rolled oats and then i'm gonna pump and probably edit some content that i need to get uploaded this week All right, guys, so my shower routine. I'm so excited to film this. I love watching shower routine videos, so here's mine. Mine's just super, super simple. So first starting off with the raw sugar body scrub. I love this stuff because I like the texture of it. It's very gritty, so I really feel like it helps to exfoliate and really make my skin really nice and smooth afterwards. Then I'm going in with the Flamingo Foaming Shower Gel shaving gel sorry yana she might start crying so if she do excuse her but the girlies was not lying when they said to use a man's razor like girl it literally gets everything then i'm going in with the paracomb md this is just a cleanser that i've been using it's just like a hydrating brightening cleanser and then y'all i'm so happy i found the brush head for my clarisonic i haven't used my clarisonic in years because of the brush head i couldn't find it like ever so amazon i found it off of there and i've been obsessed like I love my Clarisonic so much. Then I'm just going in with the Feminine Wash from Honey Pot. So I use a bar soap. I know some of y'all are probably like, girl, what? But yes, I like this bar soap from Ivory. Um, it's very light to the scent. And I use it because Yana, she lays on my chest. She be on my arms. So I really don't want anything too harsh or too strong that'll break out her skin. I'm going in with the good old Faithful, the Cocoa Butter. It's moisturizing the body. And after that, I'm using this Keys. It's kind of, I forgot the name of it. It's like a rice powder exfoliator. Um, it's kind of like the Tatcha one. It works pretty well. So I'm just going in with a toner from Good Molecules. I'm really, really loving their line. It works so well for my skin. I'm not irritated or anything by it. Then the Ula Hankerson. This is the Odie But Goody. The Truth Serum is like my favorite. So the Keys Moisturizer, it feels really nice on the skin. It feels really hydrating. But I will give you guys my final thoughts because I only used it for like a couple days. So stay tuned for After that. After that, I like to use a facial roller. This one is from Keys. This just really helps to penetrate the product deeper into the skin. And then I love to use the Vaseline Lip Balm in a LYS Speak Love Lip Oil. This combo works every time my lips is always soft and hydrated. I'm in such a better mood. I feel better. I really think starting back or working out has a lot to do with it because some days I was just literally just in bed, not doing much. And I really think just working out and kind of like just staying consistent with YouTube. And I'm starting to post a little bit on TikTok. I'm trying to get better with TikTok. I always struggle with it, but posting on TikTok. I haven't started back posting on Instagram, just like in my stories, but not on my feed just yet. But yeah, like just posting and just showing back up is helping a lot. And I honestly just got a whole new mindset. And the book that I'm reading is helping a lot. Like it's just such an eye-opening book. I feel like falling. And it's so good like when people notice like and actually several people have like commented and just told me you're doing so good with your YouTube. Keep it up blah blah blah. I have this one Instagram friend. She is just like you are doing so well. You've been killing it with YouTube and everything. And it's just so nice to like hear that because it's so crazy how you can think that you're not doing that well or you need to be doing more. But people looking in can think that you are literally killing a game. And and so this is just giving me reassurance that, you know, even though it feels like I'm not doing much or I should be doing more. Because, you know, we have those days. So yeah, I'm just I'm just happy that I'm being consistent at something. So I'm gonna keep being consistent at it and yeah. I also want to say this to anybody who may need it. Make sure you are taking the time out your day, your week to just 
be by yourself to be with yourself if that's you know a 10 minute day 30 minutes a day whatever that looks like for you and have your own self-care moment day it don't even necessarily have to be outward appearance if you need to feed yourself if that's reading your bible if that's just reading a book if that's a working out do that do whatever makes you feel good because if you don't feel your best it's gonna be hard for you to pour into somebody else so take that time out and pour into yourself because you deserve it Okay, y'all, the brows are done. That's what they look like. I'm gonna tint them tomorrow. I was gonna tint them today, but I forgot. I have to wait a little bit before I tint them since I just waxed them. The mustache is gone. <laughs> Yana, she's up, so I'm about to go get her. Look at her holding her head up. Boo boo, look at you. Hey, I'm right here. Hi. Man, I have to file her nails every other day. Her nails are so sharp and she's like been scratching her face. Did you have a good nap? Hmm? I think she acts like me when she wakes up because she's so dramatic. She has to do all her little stretches, all her little moans and groans. Right? Right, boo boo? Hmm? Right? Let's go. All right, y'all, I'm gonna feed her and then I will be back. All right, you guys, so let's get into this hair. So I'm, well, y'all know, the hair is going through its transition right now. It's shedding and everything. And I'm just not here for it. So I kind of wanted to either do some color. I don't know if that'd be a good idea since it's shedding. Or I wanted to do a sew-in. This time I might pay somebody to do it because I don't feel like braiding my hair down and all of that stuff. Um, or I was thinking about getting some braids too, you know, it'll just be, I don't have to deal with it, literally just wake up and it'll be done. And plus, since I'm working out a lot now, I think braids will probably be the way to go because I really don't have to deal with my hair at all. I wouldn't have to deal with leave out. So I don't know. We will see. It's still up in the air. Y'all let me know. What should I do? Okay, you guys. So I'm about to tint my eyebrows so when I wake up they'll already be done so I'm using the instant eyebrow tint I got the color dark brown I did this before and it worked really well um, you can do it up to three times okay so the workstation you got number one and number two and it's basically for the colorant and the activator so number one you put on one two you put on two it comes with like a little stick but I didn't like the stick so I'm using a pencil brush and let's do it and they say to leave it on for a minute Okay, so this is what it's looking like right now. So I say to leave it on for two minutes and then I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna just take a little water with a cotton ball and just start to wipe it off. Like so. Okay, hold on. Yes. But really the activator is what makes it dark. So with that, you literally just leave it on for a minute. Don't be like me and leave it on for like, I think I left it on for like four minutes. My brows was trash. So I'm just working really fast because I'm doing both sides. Last time I tried to do it, I wasn't going really fast, but like I said, I know now. And literally the longer you keep it on, the darker your brows are gonna be. All right, so I'm taking it off now. I literally left it on for a minute, like it said. So it's still dark to me, but it do fade like a couple days, so it's okay. What it looks like is definitely dark, but it's totally fine. But it's not bad, you guys. I take a little bit of eye makeup remover from Neutrogena and just kind of go over it. And it looks pretty good. It's not like, it's not bad. So yeah, the brows are on. <laughs> Highly recommended. I feel refreshed now, you guys. Skin is looking good and the nails are looking good. <laughs> the hair is probably gonna last maybe for this week, but I'm totally fine with it. I just wanted to do something to like, I don't know, make myself feel good. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was definitely needed. I feel great. So I thank y'all so much for watching. Make sure you like the video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you haven't joined the family. 
And until next time, I will see y'all in my next upload. Bye.